cannot defend this. He cannot defend this. Wait, I'm just gonna go with my ability for the bowler. Nice. Wait, I think the bowler's out. Wait, the bowler ability is isn't isn't it hitting tower? Yo yo yo! Look at the balloon. One, two shots, three shots. Yo, is that just gonna take his tower? Yeah. <laughs> yo, what is up, ladies? How are you doing? Today I'm going to be playing the best deck that I found for the second arena in the Goblin Queen update or challenge. I don't really know what to call it, but the second arena, um, you guys finally get the Goblin Curse spell. And honestly, guys, I'm not that impressed with it. Like, sure, it can... It can be a deal breaker at times and be super, super annoying, but I feel like in general, it's just not that good. Now guys, a lot of players are actually using Lava Hound. And so Wizard is just an absolute freak of nature. Also, Monk is so good. I don't know why, but like, dude, it kind of just obliterates everything. By the way, no one has defense against Balloon, and I just did basically the full tower damage in the first, what, minute, basically? With the first push. I mean, this deck is so strong. Like, guys, this guy is not going to win. I don't think I've lost a single game in... Go. I can't even remember the last time I lost, to be honest. Like, this deck is just so strong, and it makes this, this just so easy. Like, I can make I can make thousands of mistakes here, and it won't matter. Now, this guy is still playing, but, I mean, it's already over. I don't know why he's playing. I mean, he has his ability here, so maybe I have to watch out. Maybe he'll get some good or decent damage. But he just used his Goblin Giant, so I'm not too worried. I think I'm just going to cycle my Spear Goblins. Maybe I can bait out something from his end. Okay, no, guess not. I will take his tower though, which is great. I'm going to go with a Monk here, just to soak up all of the furnace shots. Okay, he's going to go with his Goblin ability, that's fine. I'm just going to go with that in the middle there. If he goes with his Goblin Giant, I will be fine. Going to go with a Wizard in the back. Okay, pretty unfortunate timing. He's actually going to go opposite lane, which is pretty smart. Pretty smart. Uh, I'm just going to go with my arrows here. Really good arrows. He is going to get some good damage here, guys. But I feel like... It won't matter. It's not going to matter, right? I should just be able to counter push here or defend the rest of the game. I have my evil wizard here and he's not going to break through. Guys, the wizard is just so strong in this game mode, bro. Kills everything. And a lot of players, like I said, guys, are just playing with decks like Lava Hound and a bunch of cards that just make the wizard shine in general. Pretty bad arrows by my end, but it's not going to matter, guys. He only has two seconds to win, and I would have taken his tower anyways. Guys, this deck is the best in the entire of Clash Royale, at least for the second arena. I'll see you guys in the next match. Guys, I just want to start off this game by saying again, thank you so much for all the support recently. It's been absolutely insane. I'm at like 540 subscribers at the time of recording this video, and I... Guys, this has literally been the fastest I've ever gotten 40 subscribers. Like, I think it was, what, four days, 40 subscribers? That's 10 new subs every day. I mean, that's absolutely ridiculous, bro. It, and uh, it means so much to me. I can't believe... I'm not gonna... I'm gonna express my love every single day. Make sure you guys understand just how um, thankful I am for all the support on all these videos. But, guys, like... It's just mental. It's just mental. I don't deserve all this love, but hey, I will definitely take it. Now, this guy's going to be playing with basically the same deck except um, that we saw last time, except it looks like he's using um, the barrel. Guys, I'm going to just show you why Balloon is so annoying, okay? Sure, he has Dark Goblin. Sure, he has Goblin Gang, but I can just arrows that, bro, and he's dead, right? I can just arrows... No one is playing against the defense against Balloon, guys. I promise. There's nothing around right now that defends Balloon. Okay, he's going to go in here. That's fine. I have my evil wizard. 
So I should be able to defend this pretty nicely. Yo, the evil wizard is an absolute chef here. Just absolutely defending everything. Yo. <laughs> the evil wizard was act is ridiculous in this game mode. And again, bro, balloon is like a serious problem. Um, he is going to have to like log or something. Maybe play a dart goblin if I'm lucky on this. Because it's just going to get a lot. Oh, wait. Did he just lose, guys? I'm just going to go with balloon here. He only has what? Goblin gang? And I can just arrows as soon. Oh, yeah. Okay, he gave up. He gave up. Oh wait, maybe he didn't give up. Maybe that was meant to be his go um, his goblin cage. I'm not entirely sure what happened there. But guys, look, he has nothing. He has nothing for the balloon, and I'm basically I basically just won the game here. I mean, I can just go with a monk here to protect my wizard, and that that gob giant's gonna actually just instant die. I'm gonna pop my monk monk ability just so I can kill that goblin brawler. I'm gonna go with arrows here. I'm gonna go with my goblins as well. All right, perfect. Um, I'm gonna go with another balloon here Okay, nice. We take his tower guys. That's what I mean like He's gonna get a lot of goblins here, but it really didn't do much. I'm not impressed with the goblin curse to be honest with you guys, so Maybe that's just me, but I feel like it's just not a good card in general I'm Gonna go with another monk here I'm gonna go with arrows on the left and yeah, this game is over Super easy defense. I took both of his towers wasn't hard at all Guys, literally, I don't remember the last time I lost. I think I've only lost two times in the entirety of this challenge. I'll see you in the next match. Alrighty, boys. Gonna hop into this game against Demon Apocalypse. Very interesting name. Um, you know, a pretty fun name, to be honest. But a, I'm just gonna win this game real quick. I'm just gonna win this game real quick. I honestly... Guys, he's using the Goblin... Uh, is that the Goblin Demolisher? I think that's called the Goblin Demolisher, right? Everyone's using the Goblin Demolisher and everyone's using the Goblin Curse. And I honestly feel like, oh, guys, those cards aren't that good. Let me know in the comments what you think of them, but... Uh, they're, I honestly think they're just kind of mediocre. You know? The Goblin Curse... Doesn't really do much, right? The, t it, the I feel like its poison effect is just... It takes too long for it to actually work. Also, I feel like the Goblin Demolisher is just kind of underwhelming in general. I mean, sure, his bomb is pretty annoying. Just because it, like, the blast does do a lot of damage, I'm not going to lie. But, otherwise, I just feel like it's just not a great card. I'm going to go with my Goblin Gang here to keep my wizard alive and just be annoying. Okay, he's going to go with this arrow, so I'm just going to go with my Monk. Okay, unfortunate that we don't actually get to keep my thing alive there, but it's fine. Um, he's gonna... He actually is playing with a mini P.E.K.K.A. Pretty interesting. So at least we bait out the mini P.E.K.K.A. I'm pretty sure my tower will take care of the mini P.E.K.K.A. Unless he, like, freezes or does something absolutely ridiculous. So, yeah, we're looking fine. I'm just gonna go with my Spear Goblins. Okay, I do have my Evil Wizard here, so I should be able to defend this pretty easily. I'm gonna go with my Goblin Cage for the night. It's also gonna help out with all the Goblins and just the Goblin... Um, Giant in general. I'm gonna go with my wizard here, and then I'm gonna go with a really nice set of arrows. I'm gonna hit some of the babies, and you know it's gonna also just kill the um, dark goblin. So pretty good arrows by my end. I'm gonna go with my balloon here, and guys, I'm pretty sure he doesn't really have anything for balloon, right? He just uses dark goblin. I guess he has the goblin cage. Wait, those arrows were so bad, guys. This is what I mean. He has to waste arrows. He has to waste log just to cycle back to something, and I get a guaranteed hit almost every time. Is that gonna be two hits? No. Pretty unfortunate. Oh wait, I just realized I just gave him like the freest amount of damage there, but it's fine. I'm gonna go with my evil wizard here, because he's gonna get to his ability pretty soon. And I just want to get to my evil wizard for his, um, by ability I mean, you know, his queen ability. I just want to get to my thing there, so I don't really have to worry about it. I'm gonna go with my balloon, and I'm gonna go with my goblins here. I'm just gonna arrows, because I'm pretty sure he has to place his tower. Okay, he's gonna miss his log, some of the babies are actually gonna go ham on his tower. And this is what I mean, guys. Like, the... It's just so easy playing with Balloon in this in this um, challenge because it, it just kills everything. It, it No one's playing with counters against Balloon. And so you just get free free damage every single time. Every single time. All right, I'll probably play one more game. I'll see you guys in the next match. Alrighty, boys. Hopping into the final match of the video against Yevhen. Interesting name. That might just be a uh, from a different language. I'm not sure. 
going to go with Monk in the back for his Goblin Giant. Monk's pushback effect is just so nice. And also, its uh, reflectability is just really good in general because... What? Ain't no way man just went bowler at the bridge. Ain't no way bolt man just went bowler at the bridge, bro. Like, that is wild. Like, I've seen some very interesting first plays before, but I've never seen that. I've never seen bowler at the bridge. Hold up. Wait, he just uses arrows. Wait, he just uses arrows. Wait, I can just... Wait, 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 um, just in case he has, like, Dark Goblin or something ridiculous. Wait, I think he just lost. Wait, I think that's going opposite lane. He just lost, right? I'm just gonna go Balloon here. I have my arrows, in case he has, like, Dark Goblin or something. Yeah, look, he has to waste his Goblin Giant. He has to go Goblin Giant on defense against Balloon. He also has to play that. Wait, this is so bad for him. I'm gonna go with my... Uh, do I even have to go with my Goblins? No. No, 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 no. This is good, this is good, this is good, this is good. good. He's gonna get a lot of damage with that Brawler, sure. It's fine, though. It's fine, though. Check out the counter push that's about to happen in, like... 30 seconds. Check out the counter push that's about to happen in 30 seconds, bro. Alright, I have my evil wizard. He only got 700 damage. 700 damage, don't get me wrong, is a lot of damage, okay? But in this mode, guys, it's not that much. I'm going to go with my goblin gain here. Uh, I'm just going to try to bait out a spell here, mostly. Perfect. Wait, this is so good. This is so good, by the way. This is so good. I'm going to go with my wizard, evil wizard in the back. Let's see if he goes with the goblin giant. Question mark. I'm about to hit double elixir. Yo, he's so dead. He's so dead. I'm going to go with my monk and plus balloon, and it's over. He cannot defend this. He cannot defend this. Wait, I'm just going to go with my ability for the bowler. Nice. Wait, I think the bowler's... Uh, wait, the bowler ability is... Isn't, isn't it hitting tower? Yo, 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 look at the balloon. One, two shots. Three shots. Yo, is that just going to take his tower? Yo, balloon's so easy. Balloon's so broken in this challenge. Guys, I just played balloon. Just play balloon. In this challenge, guys, if you're trying to get free wins, play Bloon, okay? Just play Bloon. I promise you guys, it will make this challenge so easy for you. Um, Yeah, I mean, this game's over. This game's over. He only has 24 seconds left. Just going to go with my Goblin Cage. If he goes Bowler behind it, I have my Monk ready. Uh, I'm just going to go with my Spear Goblins. Trying to save my uh, Monk ability for now. Okay, he's going to go with Log. That's fine. That's fine. Beautiful. That Monk just absolutely obliterated everything. I'm going to pop my ability here. Just to stall out, and yeah, boys, let's go. GG's. Super, super easy gameplay, because literally, this is the best deck for the second arena. What's it What's it called? The, uh, okay. Yeah, Mud Pit. Literally the best deck for the Mud Pit. Seriously overpowered, guys. Doesn't even use Goblin Curse. Doesn't even use Goblin Demolisher. So if you guys don't even have them... Which you guys, which won't be, uh, you know, the, the case. But even if you didn't, this would be so, everyone could play with this deck, you know? And it's just so strong. Hopefully, you guys, you like this type of video. Tomorrow will be the next arena up. Um, super excited to play with the Goblin Machine. It looks absolutely, insanely strong. So that would be fun. But anyways, guys, if you like this video, please like and subscribe. Thank you again for all the recent support. It's absolutely insane. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.